Catherine, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As requested, here's a video about Chrome extensions that really does the job to make our student lives easier. So after a day of browsing to my Google extension store, I discovered genius ways for organization and productivity by the help of those tiny icons on Chrome. Before we start, you know the drill. Make sure to subscribe to this channel and click the bell beside it for you to be notified whenever I post new videos. So if you guys are really, really interested, please keep on watching. Watching. For the first Chrome extension is Momentum. I know this is pretty much overrated but I think it deserves the hype. Momentum does tons of things. To get yourself a new tab, you can click this tiny icon or just click the plus sign. Instead of seeing a usual Chrome tab, Momentum will give you a different view. It has this aesthetic nature background that changes every day and the code at the bottom. So each day you have a brand new background for your tabs. What I love about this one is you can customize it according to what you really want. You can add your name and change it as well. Just click these three dots to change the usual clock into a percent clock, but I prefer the usual one. Below, you can type your main focus for the day. So for example, my main focus is to study. And you can check it out once you are done doing it. In addition to, this Chrome extension allows you to list your tasks and activities for the day or for the week. For the second Chrome extension, it's called Google Dictionary. So for example, I am studying about the Constitution and while reading this article, I read some unfamiliar words. So for example, I don't know the meaning of this word. So by highlighting it, Google Dictionary will give you the meaning of the word. So instead of going to another tab, this Chrome extension will help you to know the meaning by just highlighting the text. Isn't it easy? I know guys, I know. For the next Chrome extension is not really associated for studying, but it really helps me to get away with annoying ads. I am easily distracted by ads popping up on my screen so I decided to use this Chrome extension and this is called Adblock. And voila, it really does the job. For the fourth extension is called Todoist. This will enable you to list your task on Chrome. Isn't it amazing? So for example, today I have to do my creative writing homework. So I just have to type it. And to add more, for example, I need to do my research report. All I have to do is to list everything here and this icon shows how many works do I need to accomplish for today. For the fifth Chrome extension is called Weva. I just use this extension to highlight text on Chrome. While sharing to you guys what is Google Dictionary, you saw me when we highlight, there's a highlighter setting popping up on our screen. So that is Weva doing its job. All you have to do is double tap the word or just highlight it manually and automatically Weva will pop up to help you highlight text. For the next Chrome extension is called Duelist. So what Duelist does is it splits your tab so while reading, you can watch videos or while viewing, you can type on Google Docs. This extension has a bunch of dimensions that you can choose from. For the next Chrome extension is called Co Feelings. This is a mood tracker. I know it's quite far from being study related, but for a student like me who wants to track my mood, this Chrome extension is really helpful. I've been using this since February and I find it really, really cute. For the 8th Chrome extension is called Cite This For Me. This is basically a website that is so much helpful in doing a research papers. This allows you to cite the study, the article, and whatnot. You can choose which format you are assigned to use. It has APA, MLA format, Harvard, and Chicago. But make sure to double check it and don't just rely on this extension because it's better to be safe than sorry. 
for the ninth Chrome extension is called Picture in Picture. So for example, I am watching a YouTube vlog or any video educational or not, and at the same time, I am also reading an article or reviewing and watching a video helps me to study more. This Chrome extension will help you see and play the video while on a different tab, or while you are using MS Word, PowerPoint, and whatnot. For the final Chrome extension is meant for nocturnals like me. I love to work at night so I needed this extension to help me at night as well. So Dark Reader helps you to customize what you see on your page. You can make it a dark mode or light mode. If you want it less brighter or you want it warmer, this extension enables you to do so. So that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys learned something new today. I highly encourage you to try this for your own selves and see if it really does the job. Make sure to comment down below if you tried some of these Chrome extensions already. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys on my next video. Bye!